Hi, this is Nicholas Bell with Ion Cinema here to review Criterion Collection's re-release of Tunes of Glory, the 1960 Ronald Neem uh, production, uh, which was released on December 6th. Uh, Ronald Neem is one of those underrated British directors. Uh, I think it's because he was so multifaceted that people uh, kind of forget that he wore a lot of hats. Uh, he's thrice nominated for uh, an Oscar. He was the cinematographer on the Powell and Pressburger film uh, One of Our Aircraft is Missing and then he was nominated for writing two David Lean pictures including Brief Encounter and Great Expectations. And Brief Encounter is of course one of the most beloved uh, romantic melodramas ever made. Uh, he eventually began his own directorial career uh, in the 1940s that stretched through the 1980s. Uh, competed at Venice twice uh, with including this film, Tunes of Glory, which won John Mills the Volpe Cup for Best Actor. Uh, I think his other Venice title was The Prime of Miss Jean Brody, which was Maggie Smith's first Oscar win. Um, anyway, uh, what Tunes of Glory does uh, is feature two phenomenal performances from Alec Guinness, who previously starred in uh, Memes, The Horse's Mouth, and John Mills. Uh, in short, Alec Guinness is this kind of blue-collar man's man, Lieutenant Colonel, who's about to give up his post in uh, post-World War II uh, Scotland, and uh, can't seem to be able to give up control. Enter John Mills, who's this rigid, uh, I'd say PTSD-suffering war veteran who, uh, safe to say, clashes with how Alec Guinness runs things. Um, as they kind of go through a power struggle, uh, there is, uh, uh, John Mills kind of isn't able to handle it, and tragic consequences ensue. The film is also the uh, debut of Susanna York, who plays Alec Guinness' daughter. Um, also notably, Kay Walsh, uh, who is in Lean's version of Oliver Twist, is uh, an old love interest of uh, Guinness's, and uh, it was Oscar nominated for screenwriter James Kennaway, who's writing from his own novel. Kennaway is also an interesting uh, element here because his uh, other bits of his filmography, he tended to uh, stray into uh, a bit of tawdry things, like the tawdry, sorry, the, the infamous uh, Peter O'Toole film, Brotherly Love, where he's in love with his sister, played by Susanna York. Um, Criterion's new release of the film has a 2003 interview with, uh, with Ronald Neem and a 2002 interview with John Mills, and there's a 1973 archival interview with uh, Alec Guinness. Uh, overall, I give the film 4 out of 5 stars, and Criterion's re-release on Blu-ray, uh, also 4 out of 5 stars. Thank you. Hey, this is Eric from MyOnCinema.com. If you want to support us, subscribe below. For more reviews, interviews, film festival coverage from Sundance, Cannes, Toronto, you want to check out these guys on this side.